Hello, I'm back. I'm Impact Friends, and here is another video with this stable diffusion 2.1 gi that I found on Twitter. Let's try it out. And this gi is a Gradio UI that runs in a collab that, you know, it runs like any other collab by running the cells here. And then we're gonna open the link and go full screen in, in another tab. The main advantage is that you don't need to run it locally and if you have trouble running the 11.11 UI then this is a good choice because it has in-painting and other features that are very useful. So here I try with a prompt of a Japanese girl in a Tokyo street and it didn't came up well but let's try with another prompt let's keep keep on and see what we can find it looks like they add some artists uh, back so I, I am going to try with the with some famous artists and see if it works for the next prompt I'm gonna use Emilia Clark R by R Germ highly detailed and I'm gonna use some negative prompts to avoid some uh, deformities and framing and that sort of issue. It's really important to use like negative prompts in the 2.1 and this one came out well. This is really fun and we're gonna try with Tom Holland, Hard by Lois, highly detailed. And this one came out very painterly, and, but the, the likeness is not so, not so accurate, I, I think. But still, it's a good result. I like the, I like the drawing, but maybe not, not, fitting for the purpose of you know representing Tom Holland I think the more this don't pick up well the, I think Emilia Clark was closest and now I'm doing like a, an anthropomorphic dog with a cowboy hat and sheriff hat and, but this one I like the result but it wasn't what I was expecting or what, what I was after really so again, still I, I like it, so not bad. I also modified the prompt to, to use a Jack Russell because I have a Jack Russell dog and this is a... Uh, I... The Jack Russell is kind of like a king, so I make him like a king. And here he is, a king with a castle in the back, a fantasy painting and that sort of thing. It came out really well, I like it. I think I did one with Disney style, so let's see. And here came up the Disney style. This one is looking a bit more like my dog. Let's go, keep going. Here I try to to do a rework on my own with the in painting. And actually, this one is the the image to image. But I forgot that I actually need to have like a. Like a closer uh, I don't know how how it works this slider is like the transformation if it goes too low then it's uh it's not it's going more like the prompt 
if if you put it too too high it goes more like the prompt yes that's 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 the thing but what it is good is the in painting the in painting is super nice so if you if you put it there basically fix the picture i i really love how it came out but sadly i tried to scale it four times with the forex scaler and it had some issue because i was on a t4 so if you wanna do forex scaler try to get like a, an a100 i think or a bigger uh, at least more RAM because I didn't have enough RAM I think it, it crashed because I didn't have enough RAM but the in-painting model is super nice and here again to test the image to image model I try with uh, this picture of Lothar Matthaus holding the World Cup in 1990 and I just in paint Ronaldo on top because that's what's gonna happen in a couple of uh, days from now <laughs> so basically uh, the image thing came up um, good enough but it's also because it's an old image and it's bleeding like all the imperfections into a new into a new picture but I really like uh, this uh, this model is really fun I like the the Scradio UI it's uh, easy to work uh, I hope you enjoy the video and if you like the video please subscribe I hope to keep improving and have a nice holiday bye